Breaking news tonight, a diver is missing after going for a swim in Eagle's Nest. That's just north of Wikiwachi Springs. And ABC Action News reporter Michael Paluska just got on scene there, now learning new information from the Hernando County Sheriff's Office. Michael? Wendy, what we're being told is that this was a free diver. The call coming in around 6.51. Now, we're at the very beginning of the state land where this leads to. Behind me, about six miles in, maybe a 20-minute drive, is where you end up at Eagle's Nest Cave System. We snapped this photo as we arrived on scene. The Fish and Wildlife officers told us that we drove through their crime scene and that we had to turn around, so we were able to snap that photo but not get any video. It's a pretty much a swamp on each side of this road leading into the Eagle's nest sinkhole cave system so we turned around and that's why we are here now and that's why you just see the picture of them now the investigators are telling us that this cave is uh, 300 feet deep in parts in january a man died here in this cave system and also in 2016 in october two people died in this cave system it is extremely dangerous extremely treacherous you have to have a permit to swim here and also you have to be an experienced cave diver to dive here but what we are learning is that this was a free diver not sure if this was a free diver that was practicing going down into the depths of this cave or just someone out enjoying the sinkhole in the water here behind me. The Hernando County Sheriff's Office tell us that divers are on the way to this area, but they will not go into the water at night. So we expect them to go in sometime tomorrow morning as soon as the sun comes up and then try to figure out where this person is and get this uh, as what at this point they're calling uh, a recovery operation. We'll bring you more information as we get it. This is a breaking story for now. We are live here in Wikiwachi. Michael Paluska, ABC Action News.